A lot has changed in the last five years, in our world and in the Department of Medicine. While it has sometimes been challenging, it has been equally rewarding. We are so proud of the Department's extraordinary contributions in education, research, and clinical care, not only within our local community, but also around the world. Take a look for yourself. The Department of Medicine is situated within the Faculty of Health Sciences at McMaster University. The Faculty of Health Sciences has 1,100 full-time faculty, 319 of which are within the Department of Medicine. Of the total $730 million of research funding generated in the Faculty of Health Sciences between 2016 and 2021, the Department of Medicine has contributed $187 million, or 25%. The department has over 800 full-time and part-time faculty in administration, research, and clinical and non-clinical services. Our faculty deliver services across Hamilton, Kitchener-Waterloo, Niagara, and beyond. Together, we accomplish our tripartite mission, education, research, and clinical care. The department continues to make a profound impact in education with our undergraduate medicine clerkships, specialty electives, 21 residency programs, and 54 postgraduate fellowship programs. We are currently training over 260 medical residents, and with our medical science and PhD graduate supervisors, we are growing and developing the next generation of physicians and postgraduate students. Over the past five years, our faculty have supervised 200 medical science graduates and 139 PhD students. Our contributions to learners and to our education mandate continues to be a top priority. Research is core to who we are. Research in the Department of Medicine is collaborative, interdisciplinary, and internationally renowned. Within the Department of Medicine, there are 47 endowed chairs and nine Canada research chairs, including some of the most productive researchers around the globe, all of whom are contributing to world-class research and innovation. Nine faculty members were on the highly cited researchers list for 2021, released by Clarivate Analytics. Funding to support research has grown from $35 million in 2016 to $56 million in 2021, a growth of 60%. Over the past five years, there has been a total of $187 million in research-generated revenue and hundreds of high-impact papers have been published by members of the department during this time. A few stand out, from assessing COVID-19 management, to polypill and aspirin treatment for CVD prevention, to diagnosing a dinosaur's osteosarcoma. Finally, we are delivering on our mission of excellence in clinical care. Providing patient-centered care is at the forefront of what we do. We deliver high-quality inpatient and ambulatory care serving a total population of over 2 million people. As COVID-19 hit our communities, members of the Department of Medicine were leaders in delivering care for patients infected with the disease. Over 2,500 COVID patients sought care at our hospital sites, almost all of which were cared for by both a learner and a faculty member in the Department of Medicine. As the Faculty of Health Sciences' largest education and research department, we have had many accomplishments over the last five years that we are proud to share. We are responding to the Truth and Reconciliation Commission's calls to action for Indigenous health and well-being through the Indigenous Health Initiative and collaborations with the Indigenous Health Learning Lodge. Our team transformed undergraduate and postgraduate medical education, including in emergency medicine, by enhancing learning while protecting students from high-risk situations, including COVID-19 exposure. We are breaking down barriers by advancing equity, diversity, and inclusion practices and becoming a leader in EDI within McMaster and beyond. We released the first edition of the McMaster Textbook of Internal Medicine in 2019, contributing to our leadership in medical education. We formalized leadership development for emerging physician leaders and created coaching supports and a mentorship program. We launched a new division, first of its kind in any medicine department in Canada, the Division of Education and Innovation. We realigned our administrative staff by division rather than hospital site to enhance our effectiveness. 
we launched communities of practice programs that are driving innovation and fostering the growth of emerging leaders within the department. And finally, our researchers are publishing research that is having global impact, and we are contributing to critical health topics that are affecting our communities, such as COVID-19, diabetes, cardiology, and infectious diseases. As a collective team, the department has made significant progress over the past five years. Our accomplishments are the result of the dedication of all our faculty and staff and their ongoing commitment to our patients, our mission, and our community. As we look to the future, we are looking to continue our excellence and impact in education, research, and clinical care. And we are setting our sights on advancing the following five key priorities. Building upon our reputation and continuing to have global impact. Attracting and retaining top talent within research and education. Fostering equity, diversity and inclusion, and Indigenous health and reconciliation. Engaging and supporting faculty to achieve their personal and professional goals. And enhancing organizational stability and faculty collaborations. We invite you to take the time to dive deeper into the five-year report to learn more about the Department of Medicine's past five years of impact, accomplishments, and successes, and learn more about what we see for the future and how we plan to continue to make a meaningful contribution to the world. Thank you.